let that chip get away. They're in trouble now. Stay focused. Oh, welcome back to Face Space, everybody. So it was just a dream, after all. What a strange dream. Hmm, alright. I need to hurry. That's right. She's waking up. Back in Face Space. Okay, that's not true. She's uh, awakened once again in the weird wonder labyrinth. You guys find yourself here uh, in uh, Face Space with me. So I'm gonna keep on playing this game for a little bit. I love this game. Okay, uh, so... I think what I was gonna do is just go through this spooky area here. Seems really significant. Oh my god! Abram? Wanderer of the Labyrinth, you shall realize your own foolishness. Foolishness? What is. Ah! <laughs> oh, you're so cool! Ah, extremely dangerous! Oh, the fight has begun. Alright, I am fighting him. That's what's happening right now. Whoa! Oh, I need to uh, be the same color as his uh, attacks, of course, so that I... Ah, don't take any damage. I also need to not leap directly ah, into him or be in his path besides. Whoa! All right, okay, all right. Time to learn his attacks post-haste. Ouch. Oh, I lost my uh, third level for the, the spirit. Oh, no. Alright, doesn't look like he has too much health. I also need to get ready for him to do that. Cool, I can do this. Cool, avoided that. We're getting close. I can actually stand here. Ah, no! Got my third level back. Can heal up, switch over to wind. Oh man, and jump. And get ready to die. Oh no, I dodged into the blast. That's not what I wanted to do. Strike, 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 strike. Strike, strike. Cool, that got me up to level 3 with Sylph also. Drain, drain. Oh, I need to be low for that one. I, I just jumped out of fear. Don't pay attention to that. Alright, now he's up here. Doesn't he look so cool when he gets over there? Man, he looks so cool all the time, but, uh... He's like a really cool looking boss. I don't think I remember Abram from the series. Uh, I, I am admittedly super rusty on the series because it's been a long time. Um, I've been meaning to sit down and completely rewatch the, uh, the anime that ran. Because I adore it. Um, like I said before, it's, it's quality is extremely high. And, uh, to watch it is to just really take in some, some OG, like, old school method anime animation. And, uh, it's great. I adore it. Like I said, huh. Um. When I do that, hopefully soon, I'll be- Ah! Didn't mean to do that. I'll be catching up. On the series. Getting familiar with the characters once again, and, uh, seeing all the stuff that plays out in the story, because it's actually a huge, like, story. There's a lot that goes on. There's history and lore. All kinds of cool stuff. Battles against evil. Monsters, beasts, wizards and witches. The sorceress, which we've already met, of course. And, uh, whatever it is that possesses her. Uh oh -ho. Almost close. Oh, very, very close, actually. <laughs> that was it. Ooh. Okay. Item get. This one is a uh, soul crystal ball. What it's used for is unknown. Oh, great. Okay, well, I see it has uh, occupied that little slot over there under the enemy bar on the top right. Hmm. Well, I can move on at least. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go back and save the game. It wasn't a tremendously difficult boss. Cool boss. And I'm uh, up to level 3 on both elements, which is great. Can I uh, jump? Nope, I can't jump through that. I really like that after image. I love how it's, uh, it just matches the um, the spirit that's at hand right now. Oh, cool. 
All right. Uh, can I just hover over that? I can. Can I hover beneath this? I can. Well, that's not too bad to get through. I. Oh my god. That seems to be an enormous problem. Just destroy that door real quick. Is that one okay? That seems to be a normal door. That. Oh, it's not a normal door. It's a door imitator. And it looks like it rolled a six on something. Oh, another uh, door pulley puzzle. Hmm. Kind of start to get a sense for these things after a while. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Alright, so every time I push the B button, that spell fires off. I need to remember. Hmm. Some of these are cool. They make you shoot, like, the floor before anything else so that you can uh, properly angle the shot. From here, it looks like I'm probably going to want to do this. Oh, nope, no, nope, no. Nope. There we go. That's the way. What's that item get? Sliding. Hold down and press jump to slide. <laughs> it was like, an, uh, uh, like a trophy of a snake or something, that, that item was. Per se, while crouching to slide, you can use this to squeeze through some narrow passageways. While controlling Salamander, sliding will change to an invincibility technique. Oh, nice. So, crouch A. Nice, I can just slide. Slide all over the place. That's a familiar technique from other games, of course. Let me switch over to Salamander, see what that's like. Be like, ha! Ah, cool, she'll dive. That's definitely gonna come in handy. Fantastically handy. Hey! -ya! Okay, guess I can uh, keep going. Oh my god, down here I was like paying attention to the level and not looking at the door imitator that was about to hit me with its poison attack. Ah, and another one, because I was thinking too much once again. Okay. Well, they were definitely trying to uh, rob me of my HP there. And of course they come right back, okay. So they're just like the rest of the enemies. Ah, another fast travel point, so now I can finally, uh, zip back to, uh, this section of the map over there. <laughs> There's a yellow lock, I can't get through that yet. Another puzzle. Arrow, shot! Wow, that worked. <laughs> I don't know if that's exactly how it was supposed to work, but it did work. And I found a halberd here. Uh, much less agility, a lot more attack. Oh, it's a uh, it's a swinging weapon, as opposed to a stabbing weapon. Swing, swing, cool. She's got a back and forth. Ah, these animations are so good. All right, well that seems significant. I uh, appreciate the attack and the uh, range. I'll always like that knife though. Jump up here, jump up here. Uh, where else did I see that I could go? Can I... Ah, no, stop. Stop forgetting about those things, man. It's not good. One of the benefits of being in phase space is that I'm not exposed to atmosphere or anything, so I can just think and breathe very freely, and I should uh, always be able to pay attention. But you know how it goes. Still just a man. Whoops, come on. There we go. Hmm. Nope, there wasn't anything else up there. Okay. So, I'll go... I don't think I have to go all the way back around, but... I suppose I could. Yeah, I think I will. Ouch! Wow, I still managed to land inside that guy's attack. Okay, okay, I get it. You guys suck. Doors. No matter... Well, actually, doors, chests, chairs, anything that could be mimicked. It's just cruelty. Alright, let me zip back over there. Cool. That takes no time at all, and these guys should definitely die in about two hits from that halberd, which I do. Whoa! Too close, too close. Um, also, I need to refill my health, and uh, I need to get... Um, Self back up to level 3 as well. Die. Much more effective with a uh, Salamando equipped. 
Oh, cool. Let me just uh, whack this a few times. Level two. Let me get this another time. Level three. Nothing else interesting over here for now. Oh, gotcha. Haha. <laughs> Not today. Um, down. Yeah, I want to go down a little bit. Ouch, I walked directly into that. I was kind of hoping I could just jump down, but nope. Oh, he's going to guard that. So I have to switch over to self to do that, and then now, of course, I'm going to have to. <sighs> Ready Salamander back up to level 3. Continue right. Level up. Nice, nice. Level 7 now. Uh, I see I have 367 gold as well. Oh. Interesting, okay. Well, I see right off the bat there's a panel over here which is inviting me to shoot it, so... Oh, that was just about the way. Nope. Nope, nope. How about here? That was it. That was it. Item get. Acquired HP up. Match HP... <laughs> wow. Ma max HP increased by 10. Max H. Whoa. Fantastic. So now I've got 110 health. Still 98 MP, though. It does replenish itself. Whack. Uh, I actually really like um, the element system, like the spirit system in this game, to be able to like empower you to just, uh, I suppose, not rely on, on healing items. It feels very free to play this game. That you can explore it, and it's like, oh man, I can't afford to go too far because I have low health, but uh, no. No, I just need to fight well, and I need to manage the spirits well, so that I can uh, drain the environment of its magic and also replenish my own health. Fortunately, not a very difficult video game. It is a lot of fun, though. I tell you what, it's not- <laughs> it's nowhere near as difficult as Symphony of the Night was for me to play. I am looking forward to going back through that as an adult. Um, it's been a while since I played it. Uh, I may even do that for the channel. I'm anxious and self-conscious because, uh, it is kind of complex as I remember. Even though I loved it so much and I love to, like, watch, you know, playthroughs and reference it. I've even made, like, voxel art of Castlevania scenes and stuff like that because it's just so cool. But, uh, I admit it intimidates me to play. Save point. Cool. Mm, this is one of those spots where, like, in a Metroidvania game, something would be hidden, but... I suppose not. Okay. Guess I'll just move along. Hmm. It was only a save area, huh? Okay. Well, I suppose I'll return, uh, left and hit that little spot there that's open. Whack! Whack! Oh, no, I meant to hit him. Pretty sure you can fall down, uh, and just, uh, easily kind of, whoa, kill all those guys. Bam! Bam! You guys don't frighten me, not anymore. Oh, I'm too low, that's why the enemies are different. I, uh, went to a hall that was too low, let me go back. Bam! Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. no gargoyles for me today, I don't think so. Shwack! Ha-ha! <laughs> yeah. Bam! Bam. No cockatrice. Your fading animation will not get me. One, two. And left. Cool, he died in one hit too. Bam! 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 Haha! <laughs> Oh, remember that feeling oh, in those Metroidvania games where you could just roll through the enemies and she couldn't even hurt me. We're not even that far in the game yet. Just think, uh, there are lots more enemy- er, well, first, yeah, there are other enemies to find, for, uh, for one thing. There's lots of more, uh, uh, lots more weapons to find, like this in particular. The jeweled bow. Finally, another bow. Less agile, but, uh, more tech. A beautiful decorative bow adorned with precious metals. Oh, look at it. It's very cool. 
Uh, I like how Deedlit is holding two spare arrows in her hand. Uh, you'll you'll see her do that in in the show and uh, in the manga. So that's very cool. She's a a very skilled rapid archer and a long range archer, I think, as I as I remember. It's gonna be so cool to go back through and and refresh my memory and all that. Whoops! I missed. Ow! Okay. Let me just uh, regroup for a second. Kill this harpy to make myself feel a little bit better. Switch to salamander to make myself feel better still. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Back up to 110 just like that and then do this. Ouch! And that was not helpful. Ooh, jump just in time. You know, I think I have yet to use Will-O-The-Wisp against uh, any enemies. I should try that. I'm sure it's very, very effective. Alright, looks like I'm still gonna want to go... go back north. Because that's where all the stuff is gonna be for me to investigate, I believe. Don't give me a hard time, man. I'm just out here. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, so now I'm reading that thing correctly. That guy has a six for fire, meaning he is completely, fully resistant to fire. He cannot be harmed by it. Oh yeah, what's a... Uh... Right, right. That's the shop. I do have over 500 gold now, and some uh, bulk weapons, so let me... Let me sell that. Yeah, Alium Bident, the Goblin Club, uh, the Imp Spear, uh, the Halberd I keep, obviously, the Old Bow can go. And, um, I don't suppose I need the knife anymore, even though it's probably my favorite. It's such a cool looking, cool functioning little weapon. Um, what can I buy to help myself? Still don't think I need the Healing Potion or Magic Stone yet, also the, either of those things. Maybe later, for sure. I do have a couple of those still. I haven't actually been poisoned or taken any status effects, so that's been okay. Um, yeah, I still can't afford the high-end stuff. Could afford the Dragon Fang, but I just got a new bow. This one is still better, but... Uh, if I continue to find cool stuff in the environment, I may not need to buy anything just yet. Oops, sorry, I didn't mean to run back into your field of activity. Bam! And of course, pick up another goblin club right away. Uh, oh, what was that? I need to go to the, uh, up and left some. And, um... Oops! Good grief. Delit. There you go. Bam! Haha! <laughs> Haven't fought these wolf guys in a little bit, um... Yep. Now I think, uh, with my enhanced jump capabilities... Oh no, I still can't get up there. Nope. Nope, I'm still gonna need an extra jump of some kind to be able to do that. Um... Can't go over there still. Uh, yeah, so I need to go north and then east. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Whoops, I did not mean to take that damage, wolf. That was a problem. Whoa, I got up to 793 gold all of a sudden. These wolves are, uh, carrying some money. Bam! Okay, let's do this. Gotta go all the way back here, of course. Which I wouldn't need Sylph to do. Oh yeah, good stuff. Level 3. Heal up some, and then uh, get Salamander back up all the way. Good, good, good. Yep, go right. Guess I'll pop over here and save real quick. It's always good to save. Oh! No, too close, too close. Alright. 
Gotta go for this, uh, it's not exactly a swim. Because she just runs through the, the water. <laughs> um... Yeah, now we can go over to the right. And see that, uh, it's a fast travel point. Oh, okay. Hmm... Okay, okay, okay. Guess I'll have to go south and, uh, east to get to that last opening I see over there. Switch to Salamander so I can fall through that safely, go over here. And, uh, over one more time. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, I see. I would not have been able to get through that gap before. But now, ha! I can. New area. Weird barriers, but, uh... Great for replenishing MP if you need it, I suppose. Oh, save spot. This is about to be something significant, I'm sure. Oh, okay. Repeatedly hit, hit, uh, repeatedly hit the gear with arrows to turn it. Cool. That's doable. Gotta wind it up and then it'll fall back down. Oh, that's a mummy. Yeah, definitely want to use fire against him. He seems to be immune to sylph. According to the dice readout. 111 damage right off the bat. I can kill it in a single strike. Repeatedly hit the gear with arrows to turn it. Alright, so I gotta do this through the gap now. Ah, interesting. As the door rises, it'll block the arrows from getting to the gear. Hmm. Whoa. Sorry, monster. I meant to get up there and sword you or halberd you or whatever the hell it is that I'm using right now. But, uh, it didn't work out. Okay. Yeah, halberd. Whoops. Yep, see, he is, uh, completely resistant to sylph. He guarded it completely. Oh no, more dragon tooth warriors. No, stay away. Whoa, definitely don't do that. Compromise my safety, you crazy, crazy guys. Uh, what's over here? Can I... I don't think I can get up there. Nope. Nope, can't do that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh no, I got trapped. <laughs> okay. Not so bad. That guy was clearly a door imitator. Level up. Level 8 now. Uh, got 7 for attack, 2.4 defense. Cool, cool. Um. Yeah. Ah. Once again. Looks like this time I'll have to, uh, ricochet the arrow. Yep. Just like that. Cool little mechanic. Not too demanding, not very hard or anything. Switch over. Get to level three. There we go. Save the game. Uh, these smoky entrances usually mean business, don't they? Hmm. Oh. Parn. Oh! A dark elf! What a surprise to think that there are others. I'm the one who's surprised. You must be... Uh, Pyrotest, right? Don't you call me by that name. If you're just a test for me, then I'll have to eliminate you. Wait, I don't want to fight you. Even if you have no reason to fight me, I have reason to fight you. Oh, great. Well then, fight we shall. Was it Pyrotest or Pyrotest? I'm pretty sure it was Pyrotest, because they probably would have pronounced it that way, right? What? Ouch! God, that is difficult to avoid. Yeah, go ahead and continue to uh, use a, a fire attack, if you don't mind. Huh. Oh, cool, I can, um, I can just turn and dodge. Ah! You know what? Eat one of these. Oh, cool, that's what that does. They're all guided. Very cool, very cool. Alright, I'm gonna have to do this, and then she's gonna try to... Whoa! I guess she'll jump. Ugh! Yeah, I was trying to predict that, um... Ah! Her 
grabbing attack or grapple so that I would not take any damage from that. Woohoo! I can do magic too! Oh, oh my god, okay. Okay. Hang on, hang on. Yep, drain. Ah, stop doing that. Nice, got her with a bow. And leveled up too. Whoa, she's exploding like crazy. Ah. Gah. So strong. But I've gotten what I needed. Hey. That's... We shall meet again. No, that's the item that I got. That I, uh, didn't know what purpose it served or was able to use it at all. Also, ouch, that took a lot of damage through that, uh, boss fight. The fights, like, I- oh, well, they're not very deep, but, um, some of these boss battles are just so, like, uh, quick and engaging, and it's like all of a sudden it's happening, and you're both doing some pretty cool attacks, and it just works for me. Stage two, nice. I love that super stylish intro to each stage with die. Everything just looks so great to me. Cool, it's like, uh, I like, um... An old European place. Kind of like the last one was too, wasn't it? Hmm. Anyways. Looks like, uh, there are now goblin chiefs out here who have bows and arrows. And they look like, um, goblin-y compound bows, as a matter of fact. Oh, maybe I should switch to Sylph and do more damage. Whoops. Okay. So, if I just repeatedly hit, uh, Y after letting it go to fling the first arrow, then I can continue firing along the same line, but uh, if I let it up for even a moment too long, it'll reset the aim. What is... Uh, are you... Oh, dangerous? Okay. Sure seems like it. Pixie. Man, what, what place is this that even Pixie should fight me? Oh, but there's a cool sword floating there. The zebra. Uh, wow, it does a lot more attack. Uh, and is still less agile besides. What's it? Whoa! Okay, this is a, an overhead swinging sword. This is a great sword if ever I saw one in this game. Okay, that's green. I guess I can't pass through there just yet. Um, I need to get uh, just a little bit more for Sylph. Die, please. Headshot? Okay. There we go. That's level three. Um, what's, um, to the right over here? Oh, kobolds. Hey, kobolds. Such a mainstay in fantasy. Oh, leveled up again, so I'm level 10 now. Fantastic. That's about all that. Whack, whack. Isn't it just so... Whoa, that was kind of close. You can die. To Arrow of Fire. Oh, got a save point over here. Uh, this kind of goes back to the left. Oh, a new bow again. Fantastic. Uh, hat trick. Oh, oh, I know what that is. A bow that can simultaneously fire three arrows, yeah. Okay, so, um, it actually does do more damage. Because of the, the group of arrows that it fires. Now, one arrow, I think, is still less powerful than... One would have been from the jeweled bow, but this group will be very dangerous, and I'm gonna find. Oh, oh, Woodchuck! Hey, Deed, have you escaped? Where is this place? Well, this is like a gambling den. Gambling's the best way to quickly drum up military funds. Gambling, you never learn, do you? You won't regret trying it. If you ever feel like gambling, let me know any time. Ah, uh, man. It actually is really cozy over here. I like these kind of places in video games. And this in particular because of the pixel art and uh, the music. Now check it out. Hey, Deed, want to do some gambling? So, there is a gambling game within this game. And it's cool. It's all about dice, as you can imagine. Just about all the rest of the, uh, the RNG and m number metrics in this game are all have, uh, related to dice. Uh, in this game, you guess the number produced by rolling three dice. Bet money on your guess, and if you guess correctly, you win the allotted amount. Guess wrong, and the dealer keeps your money. 
So this covers all of the different bet types. Um, I think this is similar to one of the card games. I, I don't know card games. I, at least I can't remember them properly. But uh, if you're familiar with any sort of gambling game of chance, then uh, you're probably familiar with these mechanics a little bit. May Chaza, God of Fortune, smile upon you. Okay, so I'm not going to spend too much time with this. We're going to take a look because uh, I don't want to waste my money. Um, I used to remember that there was like a safe, there was like a few safe bets to choose. Pair allotment six, straight allotment, pair, total double. Of course. For right now, I'm gonna go for the, uh, the small. We're just gonna bet ten, see what happens. Select the numbers, be like, uh, bam. And then bet that, and then, uh, the straight... Bet that, and then I guess I'll guess this pair right here. And, uh, basically if the dice, if we get any of those, um, those bets, then I'll get some money. Six, a five, and a three, so, uh, yeah, I lost. <laughs> That's exactly how this works. Roll three dice, uh, you just have to guess what amounts are gonna show up on the faces, man. This is not exactly what I'm here for in this game, though, so I'm gonna get up from this table. It was cool hanging out with you. I'm gonna shoot you with an arrow. And move along. Gambling is for another time. Alright, kobold. Get- whoa, don't- don't hit me with the- the flying weapon. Looks like I can still go south too, but uh, I'm gonna continue trekking north for this right here. Oh man, yeah, I can just like cover his entire space with arrows. Oh, that last one still hit me now. Recoup my uh, HP. It doesn't look like I'm gonna be able to get up there. Does not appear. Nope. All right, so let's uh, go back down. Ha! Ha! Yeah! Oh, those are spikes. Whoa! Do not fall on the spikes. We are gonna come over here and do that. Uh-huh. Well, if you're gonna be that way, then I'm going to rain arrows down on your body. And continue south. Any spikes down here? Yes, there are. Maybe I should just assume that that's gonna be the case. Got another fast travel point. Some more area over here. Mm -hmm. Oh, what is that down there? What is that? What is that? That's a scarlet vulture. It seems resistant to salamander entirely, so I'm gonna do that. And that kobold is annoying, so I'm gonna shoot him with a bunch of arrows, as many arrows as possible. And uh, also the scarlet vulture, because it's really fun to shoot arrows in groups like that. It's cool that, uh, so early in the game, whoa, you get, um, cool weapons that can do cool things. It feels very rewarding. Oh, no, that seems very dangerous. Oh, the flame damage can be negated while controlling the spirit of flame, of course. Okay, so, um, it, it does seem like there's magma down there. Can I, yep, I can just... Run through magma. No problem. Ow. Get. Uh, oh, oh, no. That's a gigantic problem. That's a gigantic problem. Stop, stop, stop. Uh, okay. That enemy was placed just to make it very, very difficult to do this. Otherwise, it'd be no problem. Guard, of course. Well, at least it doesn't seem to have a ranged attack. It doesn't fire anything at me. Haha, <laughs> fire. Mmm. Can I get under here? I can. Oh! Great, great. Um, can I not? I, I can't? Really? Okay. <sighs> Perhaps if I hover, I... Nope. Nope, sure can't. Uh, great. Well, I guess I just needed to be fast enough to get through there. No, I have to reset the area and fight those blasted vultures again. Okay, well. Um, I need more... Ow! 
now. I need more attention to pay. <sighs> well, that uh, didn't set me back very far. Okay. Die. And, um... Uh -huh. Nope. Oh no, I thought I could dodge that, but it passes straight through each part of the stage, no problem. Ouch, so did that. Fine. Hmm. Nope. This is definitely not gonna work trying to hit these guys with the, uh, the melee. Recover that HP. It's still kind of funny that, uh, pixies are such enemies in this game. Ha! <laughs> I was hoping I could do, like, the, the pogo stick. Ah, no, jump on with the sword down, but I can't. Ow. <laughs> no. Uh-huh. I see you down there. Ugh, it takes, at these low levels, so much damage to kill even the basic enemies. Well, a few steps above basic, I suppose. Okay, got self up to level two. Oh no, I was on the wrong power. Okay, okay, no problem. Right, right. Whack! Uh-huh. Green lock. Can't the uh, green locks yet. Mm-hmm. Let's see, can I just, um... No. No, I cannot. Alright, kobold, behave. Good, good. Uh-huh. Die, die, die. Whack, whack! It sure does have a huge uh, area of attack, doesn't it? This, uh, this zebra sword. It's cool, it just, um, if, you know, an enemy's lower than me, I can't really do too much about it. Okay, so what was this area over here? This seems to have a lot going on. Yep, that didn't do them any damage at all, and they can guard against that in total. Alright. Bam, bam, bam! So can I get you? Can I get you? I can. Heal up a little bit, and, um, wander back in here. What is... Oh, okay. So, I need to have... Can I shoot through? Yeah, I can. Oh, wow. It ricocheted. Huh. Okay. So, I can't move <laughs> around this pillar, but I can shoot around it. Uh, what? Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, that was weird. Uh... Huh? Okay, well, I think that there may have just been a weird situation with the game. And uh, I've been playing for a little while anyway, so I'll tell you what, guys. Uh, join me back here in Phase Space next time I'm gonna continue playing. Deedlit in Wonder Labyrinth. Um, and get through this, uh, this weirdness. Don't worry. It'll be just fine.